Hi guys and good morning. It's around, I guess it's around 8:27 in the morning and basa pa yung buhok ko bago umligo pa si Ate. Today I am going to make a review, my own review about this Dream Velvet foundation that so I bought this Dream Velvet foundation at Watson's department store sa SM Mandawi as SM Mandawi. I bought it for 350 pesos because at that time when I went there they sell it for 350 pesos my my discount sila. Yung original price niya is 500 pesos. So I just bought it for 350 pesos. And I'm in the shade nude 40. Yeah. Similar kay Janina Vela na color ng foundation. This foundation is a 30ml foundation. It says here na fresh, new, and flawless dream velvet whips a fresh gel into a velvet soft and smooth with a soft matte finish just like velvet. Skin feels, feels fresh with lasting hydration. Ganyan yung kaniyang um, claim. So, matte foundation siya. So, I'm gonna test it out using my uh, Miracle Sponge, Real Technique Miracle Sponge. And I'm so sorry. Kasi <laughs> marumi siya, hindi ko siya na clean. So, I'm gonna test this out. And in this side of my face, I'm going to put my favorite, as of the moment, the Quick FX. Um, no shine mattifier na primer so i'm gonna apply primer in this side and in this side hindi so para ma compare ko siya at the end of the day kung ano yung mas better or ano yung resulta ng foundation na to dinadat ko lang siya kasi ayo kasi yung skin ko parang hindi siya gaanong maganda i have large pores kaya sometimes it leaves like parang patchy yung dating niya kapag nilalagay ko siya na ano yung using a brush it feels like ano lightweight lang wala din siyang smell wala siyang smell ooh i like it i hope na magtagal tong foundation to the whole day it's very good to test this out today kasi it's so hot it's summer so ang ganda ng test out to yung kanyang mattifying and longevity I like picking lighter shades of foundation, lighter than my skin tone. Kasi, ano ako, nag oxidize yung foundation sa akin. So, if lighter yung foundation na ginagamit ko, it's, bet, um, it's better sa akin. After mga an hour. So, tinatap ko lang siya. And in fairness, yung mga large pores ko dito na side, hindi siya, ano, Gaanong visible. This side of my face. So, walang primer. That, that lang pa rin. I like it. Kasi pa ta apply siya ng okay na okay sa skin mo. As in, madali lang siyang i-blend. Similar lang yung finish niya. Pero parang mas matte dito pang mas mat dito. So, I'm gonna set this and then afterwards, mabalik ako after I done with my makeup. And ito yung aking look ngayon kasi, ano, magpupunta lang din naman ako sa store and doing my routine as a cashier there. So, it is now around 8.43 in the morning. And babalik ako mamaya. I'm going to bring you using my camera. And then I'm going to update the entire day until the end of my day. So para meron kayong idea how this foundation works into my skin. So I forgot to tell you guys na I am the type of a person that has in an oily skin. So this foundation is really perfect for me to test this out at this time. Kasi it's summer then. Where's my the key of my bike? Oh, there. And um, I think it will last long. Siguro. I'm not quite sure. Cause 
quite a quite a while nagtry ako ng tinatry ko to and so far i like it but gusto kong i-share sa inyo kung paano kung ano yung gamit na gamit ng foundation na to so yon i'll be right back in a while so hi guys i'm back and um it's around 11. Not is some little bit shiny here, here, here. There are stuff the moment. Okay, okay, pasha. Okay, pasha masyadong ganun ka. Hala. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna check me here again. Primer na ginamit ko, parang hindi siya naka survive all throughout the day. Tingnan nyo, nag oil up siya dito, tsaka dito. Oh, tingnan nyo. Papakita ko. Ayan. Ayan. Here, oh. And, malagkit-lagkit na siya sa face ngayon. Malagkit na talaga siya sa face ngayon, guys. It feels lightweight pa rin. Ito yung aking final verdict for this foundation. So, ang first is, I'm going to state muna kung ano yung mga hindi ko gust nagustuhan sa foundation na to. Hindi ko lang nagustuhan sa foundation na to is, Hindi siya nag-survive all throughout the day. And, um, ano, kapag dilalagay ko siya sometimes, if nag oxidize ako, di ba nabanggit ko dito sa clip na to na nag usually nag oxidize yung face ko, meaning nag-darken yung foundation kapag nagtatagalan sa, sa face ko at kapag, ano, may mga pawis na na-form sa face ko, yun, nagda-dark yung foundation. So, yung previously, nung gumamit ako ng foundation na to, it feels like um, yung yung naganap is parang nag-form dito na side ng ano, yung parang patchy, patchy na effect. Yung parang nagde-dry up dito, nagpo-form siya dito, namumuo siya dito na part ko, tsaka dito sa nose ko. And, yun yung ayaw na ayaw ko sa kind of foundation, sa mga foundation. Kaya, I prefer BB creams for daily basis rather than foundations. And, for my pros, as in yung gustuhan ko sa foundation na to, it's first, it's price. It's very affordable compared to the other foundations that I've seen. Drugstore foundation that I've seen in the market. It's squeezable tube because it's very handy. Handy siya guys. So, ito. Handy siya, ba? Ang liit-liit niya. And you, it's very convenient for those women who are fun of traveling. Tapos, tatlo. It's a matte. It has a match. It has a matte finish. And Fourth is lightweight siya sa skin. Kapag nilalagay mo siya or ina-apply mo siya, lightweight siya at hindi siya parang ano, yung have, meron kasing typical or type of foundation na it's a very thick, it has a very thick consistency and kapag nilalagay mo siya, parang ang kapal-kapal, parang you're wearing mask all throughout the day. Fifth is after you apply the foundation, it feels hindi siya sticky. Usually, sa mga foundations ko na na-try nung before, ano siya, parang pag naglalagay ako after 20 to 30 minutes, nag-oil up na agad yung face ko kasi I'm really oily as in dito sa part, oh, and then dito din, tsaka dito, and dito. Dito, nag nagperform din ng mga dry patches dito na side. Na, na part ng face ko. So, hindi siya madaling mag-produce mag ng shininess sa aking face. Considering kanina, ha, nag-motor pa ako papunta ng store, tsaka ang init-init, ba? Wala masyadong oil na na-produce. Kung alam nyo lang kung gano'n ako ka-oily, nalaman nyo din yan in the near future kasi may another foundation din akong i pre reviews so, yun lang guys ang aking review about this Maybelline Velvet Foundation. So, yung aking masasabi lang, for those ladies that gustong mag-budget and gustong ng matte finish, usually dito naman mga Pinoy matte finish naman yung hinahanap, this one is really perfect, especially then sa mga students dyan na who wants to start off using makeup. Ito yung ma-advise ko sa inyo. 
kapag nil ginagamit nyo to, um, di ba sabi nila, nag-create ito ng pimple or nag-cause ito ng pimple. After yung gumamit the whole day ng, um, any, any foundation, any makeup, you need, you really need to remove it. Like, hindi lang remove na you go to your bathroom and then take or get your whatsoever na facial wash and then boom, sleep na na agad. Excited. So anyway, so ako, before I go to the bathroom, I usually clean my face using this Pure Derm Vitamin uh, Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelette. I guess it's only... Magkano ba ito? Mga 99 pesos lang. And 30 wet wipe towelettes na siya. 30 use. And then, after na after kong gumamit nito, I go to the bathroom and then clean my face with my um, facial wash, which is the eye white Korea na facial wash, yung violet. And then afterwards, I apply this as toner, alcohol-free. So it I think nakaka-help din siya na mag-clean nung ating mga force at yes, after we apply the makeup. Diba? Kasi it's oily. It's hot here in the Philippines. And, um, nafe-feel ko parang pumupunta sa loob yung mga ginagamit natin. Tapos may mga dust pa all throughout the day. Diba? So, we need to clean it before going to bed. Yon lang ang aking review about the foundation. And, thank you for watching this video. I hope na may natutunan kayo sa video ko. And, sana mag-subscribe kayo. And hit the bell button if you want to get notified to these videos or to this channel. So guys, if meron kayong mga comments or any suggestions, you can just comment down below and or email me in my social media accounts. I want to just inform you that I I am you going to start or I am starting to upload videos every night. So, alternate lang. Once a week, meron akong vlog. Tsaka every night, meron akong different type of video na i-upload every single night. So, stay tuned for that guys. And, thank you guys for watching. And I hope na don't forget, this is me, Miss Tina Valencia and I am your Kachikahan in this channel. Okay, bye-bye guys and see you in my next video. Bye!